Hi there, it's Tuesday the 4th of May 2021 and this month begins a new series for us at church looking at the empowering spirit, the empowering spirit of God. Of course, God is present in this world today by his spirit, the Holy Spirit. And for those of us who are believers, who are Christians, God promises that he will live within us by his spirit. And so we are able to be filled with his spirit and live by his spirit day by day. In fact, this week, that's what we're going to be looking at, being filled with the Spirit. Six times in the book of Acts, it talks about being filled with the Spirit. And we're going to look at those scriptures each day from now until the end of the week. Now, we're going to look at our first scripture, and that's found in Acts chapter 2, verse 4. And it says, all of the disciples were filled with the Holy Spirit and began to speak in other tongues uh, or languages that could be translated as, as the Spirit enabled them. So we see here that there is a gift of uh, speaking in tongues, which the Holy Spirit gave to his disciples when they were filled with the Spirit. That gift which came to them is one of the many spiritual gifts which the Holy Spirit gives us in our life day by day as we need those gifts in order to live the life that God has for us. Now, I don't know if you like getting gifts. I'm sure you probably do. Here's a nice gift bag here. And uh, let's see what gift I have been given in here. We have, ah, a paintbrush. A nice new paintbrush for my art. We all like to receive gifts. Gifts can be given with great thought and great uh, care and attention by people who know us. And they know exactly what it is that would just bring joy to our lives and uh, empower us in our lives to be able to do those things that we want to do. And God knows exactly what we need and he gives gifts to us, spiritual gifts, uh, day by day as we need these gifts within our lives. There are all kinds of spiritual gifts within the New Testament, of course. There's the gift of speaking in tongues, as we see here. There's the gift of prophecy. There's the gift of leadership, the gift of administration, the gift of pastoring, the gift of teaching, the gift of helping, the gift of encouraging others. Many different spiritual gifts that God gives us. And some of these gifts remain with us for the rest of our lives. And some of them perhaps are for particular periods of our life or in particular situations that we need these gifts. But God knows exactly what spiritual gifts we need. And we receive these gifts as we are filled with God's Spirit. As we allow God's Spirit to fill us then he can fill us with that gift, that gift of teaching, that gift of encouragement. And so that encouragement, for example, that we are filled with that gift of encouragement and we are able to overflow with that gift. It's like filling a glass of water and keeping on filling it until it overflows. As we are filled with God's Spirit and those gifts which he gives us, then they flow out to others. That teaching, that helping, that encouragement, whatever that gift is. And it's there not just to bless us, of course, but to bless others and to bless the world. I wonder what gifts, what spiritual gifts God has given you as you are filled with his spirit. Speak to you again tomorrow.